All right. We, we, uh, good practice today, by the way. We put in four minute grind offense, uh, which is so important. It comes up about four or five times a season. The better you are, it comes up a lot more. Uh, and we were pretty good at it last year until the bowl game. You know, so we, Vanderbilt, Kentucky, we had good grind offense going and won the game. And uh, the bowl game, we screwed it up and it cost us. So we obviously want to end the game on offense and take a knee. And certainly when the defense is out there and we got to get the ball back, we got to do it. So uh, it was a good start on that situation. And, you know, a lot of young guys, so trying to teach them to be situationally smart uh, is so important. And that takes a lot of reps, understanding the situation, just not running plays. So that's what we did today. Did you see some of that today from the offense, just maybe an eagerness to get back out here? They were good. The whole team was good. And, uh, you know, I, 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 I can't complain. You know, I, I call it like I see it, guys, and I'm going to do that all the time. And when we're, I feel like we're working hard and doing good and we don't have a lot of emotion and drama that's uh, impeding our progress. But that doesn't mean we're a good team. You know, that's where I, you know, sometimes y'all get confused. Um, it just means we're coaching the right stuff. We're, we're coaching the techniques, the discipline of doing things the right way and doing it over and over and over and over again. You need a lot of consistency. You know, probably the biggest uh, disappointment in the scrimmage was our operation on offense. And, you know, we talked to Tyler a lot about it. we were just too slow. And we put a lot on it, on alerts and kills and checks. You know, so we're going to do some things. we got to tighten it down as a coach, do a better job of coaching. And, you know, so Tyler can get in there and groove it a little bit. That's what we're doing now. we got a night one tonight. This is our first two-a-day, so... Uh, we don't want to get all excited because we had a good practice. We have 20 of them here before camp breaks. Do you ever have to get on to the guys, or uh, do you worry about going into the first two a day? Like some might be loafing or holding back a little in the morning so that they have some juice to go at night. You know, they haven't done that. Um, so we, 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 you know, we go in shells at night, so we don't have the same kind of practice at night. Uh, but they can't worry about the night practice, and none of them really did. They came after it pretty good. And, we have plenty of time to recover. We get two meals in them, so uh, we don't we don't do the morning afternoon deal. We do a morning and night, which allows them to get a good meal after practice, recover, and then another meal, which helps the recovery process a little bit. Do better. they go through meetings during the day? Yes, we'll do a meeting this afternoon, then another little install meeting before practice. So they'll have two different meetings. There's been a lot of talk about the young about the young cornerbacks, the newcomers. How have your corners, vet, corners, yeah. How have your veterans sort of responded? You guys like Art Evans. Yeah, you know what? I tell you, I was, uh, I had a real frank meeting with our football team right in the beginning that it's our job as coaches uh, to bring in the best talent we can bring in uh, to promote competition. And two things happen when you have competition. Number one, you get better individually because you got somebody pushing you. Uh, and number two, our team gets better. Even if you get beat, beat out, our team gets better. So as hard as it is internally, uh, when you just look at yourself, it's hard. But understand it's our professional responsibility to do that. And uh, our, our seniors have been great. You know, I, I read what Daryl Vereen said. I mean, we got these young cats in there, and he's for the team. And he's got a role, and Art's going to have a role for us to help us. Um, they, their attitude's just been great, and, and I've, I've been appreciative of it, but that's the way it should be on a team.